Five Unusual People in the World, Part Seventy Five. Hello, you guys. I'm Kisha, and wish you all the best and happiness. Many people have a special appearance due to a rare condition at birth or during adulthood. I have got some incredible people to talk about today. Let's find out together with this video. Are you ready? Let's begin. Number five, Wang Fang. Wang Fang, born in 1985 from Chongqing City, China, had unusual deformities in her legs and arms right from birth, surprising doctors and family members. Unlike normal people, Wang's feet do not point forward but rotate 180 degrees backwards. I think with feet like that, she would go backwards faster than forwards. But the truth is completely different. She is no different from ordinary people, except for putting on shoes from backwards. Even in the middle of a crowd, you cannot tell the difference without looking closely at the shoes she's wearing. At first, doctors feared that Wang would not be able to walk like a normal person. However, with an extraordinary will, Wang not only walks like many others, but she also runs faster than most of her friends. She currently works as a waitress in a family-owned restaurant. She has had a two-year-old son and refused to receive any financial assistance provided by the state for her disability because of she does not consider herself disabled. One thing for sure is that no one wants their child to have a strange disease or even a normal illness, but not everyone has that luck. Number four, Trini Amuhirmi. Trini Amuhirmi, born in 2008. From Uganda, became strange in the eyes of neighbors and famous throughout Uganda because she has a huge tumor on her face that made her face deformed and caused many difficulties in life. According to the doctors, Trini has fibrous dysplasia, a rare bone disease that destroys normal bone with fibrous bone tissue. Trini's huge tumor made one of Trini's eyes bulge out and unable to see anything. Her right teeth and nose were pushed out of her face. This strange tumor has appeared and developed since the girl was more than four years old. At first, her face only had a small piece of bone protruding, but gradually the bone grew larger. Trini has undergone two surgeries at the place where she lives with her family in Uganda, but the tumor has been growing steadily. Now it weighs about 4.4 pounds. A 15-hour operation was performed by the world's top doctors. The cost of the surgeries is estimated at more than 65,000 pounds, funded by the charity Facing the World. After the surgery, Trini has got better and can eat and drink normally. She can see the world around her and laugh happily with others. No one can predict what will happen to them in the future. The next man has a strange disease, which only started to torment him when he got married. Number three. Surinder Sharma. Surinder Sharma, born in 1971 from India, encountered a serious strain disease. It severely ravaged his body with thousands of tumors growing on the face and body, which make his skin look like toad skin. The cause of the condition was unknown, and doctors suspected it was neurofibromatosis, a condition that causes tumors to grow along nerves. When he was 20 years old, the first lumps appeared on the face. His father also had these signs. So Mr. Sharma ignored and ignored the first warning signs. Unfortunately, it got worse and worse, and within a few years, has spread to his entire body. This strange disease makes him look very scary. Yet, every time he is informed that treatment is only possible in advanced hospitals in big cities like Delhi. With four children and a wife to raise, Surinder had to give up his dream of getting treatment. Mr. Surinder Sharma said he himself did not feel any pain from the tumors. But when the body sweated, the tumors would make him feel itchy and extremely uncomfortable. He is hoping for a treatment that could cure his condition permanently and return him to his youthful appearance. For children, crying is their way of communicating with adults and the world around them. Parents often do not understand what their children want just through crying. What if my baby doesn't cry? Do not be subjective because your baby may be suffering from a strange disease that is difficult to treat. Number 2. Gabby Gingras <laughs> 
Gabby Gingras was born in 2000 from Minnesota with an extremely rare disease. Babies do not know pain, even when chewing their own fingers or poking and scratching their eyes. Nerve pain signals transmitted from the surface of the body to the brain never worked in her. According to doctors, she has HSAN, a very rare genetic disorder that affects the sensory nerves. In Gabby's case, the nerves that help detect pain and the sensation of ambient temperature are both undeveloped. To put it more simply, Gabby felt no pain and so on. Gabby chewed and bit her three fingers. She also chewed her tongue so much that her parents decided to pull her teeth out. Doctors were forced to remove one of her eyes because Gabby repeatedly poked and scratched her own eye. She can also break her own leg without even realizing the injuries she caused. To help her child control this painless disease, Gabby was taken by her parents to many places for treatment. Currently, Gabby is doing well. Her ability to perceive danger has improved. She can proactively avoid unwanted injuries. Number 1. Nikia Phoenix Nikia Phoenix was born in 1980 from the US. She is an entrepreneur, model, and fashion blogger. Nikia has a face covered with freckles. According to Allure, the female model wants to inspire a lifestyle for those with freckles like her. These freckles appeared since she was 4 years old. At that time, freckles were considered unfashionable. Nikia didn't think anything was strange until she got to school. Friends around her pointed at her. They laughed and said, You have freckles. There is something wrong with you. For years, people stared at her as if she were an alien because of the black spots on face. As a teenager, Nikia tried to cover her freckles with makeup. In the end, this woman didn't want to hide them anymore because those freckles are really pretty. More and more people are accepting them. After moving to Los Angeles, she began her modeling career. Before that, Nikia participated in a number of local modeling contests. Nikia says that, if given the choice, she wouldn't change her skin. Freckles make her own identity, make her stronger. She prides herself on being a black woman with freckles. This is why she created the project, Black Girl Beautiful. She has always wanted to help women of color around the world harness their hidden power. That's all for today. Hope you guys enjoy it. There are many other very special people. Please click on the videos in my channel to see them. Thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell to watch more interesting videos. And now, goodbye and see you again.